so Brad's workbench I had spoken to a while back. He had stated he wanted me to do a review on this. Um, I've had it about, I think, six or seven months, maybe a little longer. Um, I told him when I got a chance to use it, I'd do a review on it. I just took pieces of the box and just taped it to it so I knew which one it is because I have a metric and a standard. They both look like the exact same case. This is a 45-piece titanium nitride tap and die set. Um, it is a nice set. I have used this set probably 10, 15 times. I haven't had any issues with it. They're still nice and clean. I oil them as you know while I'm using them. I oil them after I'm done with them. This is a 5/8. I've used this quite a bit. Um, I haven't had seen any wear or tear on them. Um, they're still just as nice as when I bought them. Uh, if you want any information on, you know, the rest of this, you know, I, you can, I believe I did a, just a, a walkthrough video of it a while back. Um, some of these I have not used. This one I have used. It's markings on it. Um, this is a 7 8 right here. Uh, this is a coarse thread. I remember what I used this on. It is also nice, it actually states it on it for you. Um, these sets have actually held up pretty well. Um, the dies are still holding up really nicely. I haven't had any problems with... Uh, any of them. Uh, I use a lot of the fine thread for the standard. Um, I think I paid like $78 or $80 for this kit. Same with the other kit. I paid somewhere around the same price for it. I just usually put the plastic back in it when I'm done. I haven't opened the instruction manual, but you know, who needs the instruction manual? <laughs> Uh, thank you for watching. Um, please rate, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. And I'll leave... Um, I'll try to leave links down in the description below for it. Thank you and you have a good day.